All right, the next part of our process, um, I have four gallons of milk in my stock pot. Um, right now this is raw milk. And so the easiest way to make cheese is to first pasteurize it. So I have my burner on almost high and um, I use this cheese spoon to uh, keep the milk sort of circulated every now and then. Um, you don't have to sit here and constantly stir. And then I bought this digital thermometer. Um, I really like it because it's very accurate within um, a tenth of a degree. And so what I do is I keep track of my temperature. Um, there's sort of some different ways that you can process or pasteurize milk. Um, but my favorite, I think, does the least damage and change to the milk protein is um, I heat it up fairly rapidly. We need to get to 165 degrees for 15 seconds. And then as soon as it gets to 165 degrees for 15 seconds, then I take my entire pot and set it in a sink filled with ice cold water. So I fill my sink with, um, first with cold water and then I add ice cubes to it so that it's good and cold. And I cool it quickly as soon as we get to that point. Um, you can heat it to a lower temperature over a longer period of time, but for me, I'm usually doing three things at once in the kitchen. Um, like you can hear the butter still mixing right now. Um, and I don't necessarily pay close enough attention to the exact temperature. So this is just an easy way to go. Um, I just check it every now and then. And as soon as I'm getting close to the 165, then I pay even closer attention hold it for 15 seconds and once you hold it at 15 for 15 seconds at 165 um, your milk is pasteurized you don't want to get it any hotter than that because you'll start changing the structure of the milk proteins um, if you heat it too quickly you'll notice sort of a skin um, uh, on the surface of the milk and you don't want to do that so if it starts to um, make a skin, then I turn the temperature down and do it just a little bit slower. Um, I'll just take my spoon and spoon that off and get rid of it. And then, um, like I said, lower the temperature just a little bit so that we don't change the quality of the milk.